Why is it said that the Viking Age started in the year 793? Were there no Vikings before that time? Of course, there were also Vikings before the year 793. But in the year 793, we have the first written stories about Viking raids. In the English Anglo-Saxon Chronicle, monks wrote down how the Vikings plundered Lindisfarne Castle. The monks were from the Order of St. Benedict and lived at Lindisfarne Castle, which is located on the North English East Coast. Where the Vikings came sailing across the North Sea in two ships with over a hundred men, the Vikings stole everything of value, including silverware and holy scriptures, and here's the story. In the year 793, a specter of doom descended upon the tranquil Isle of Lindisfarne. The rhythmic hymns of the pious monks were abruptly drowned by the ominous creaking of Viking longships breaking through the horizon. Little did the unsuspecting friars know that their peaceful haven was about to become the epicenter of a seismic shift in history. Behold the Vikings, relentless warriors from the north, draped in fearsome armor, and sailing upon vessels adorned with dragon heads, the heralds of an age destined for chaos. This fateful encounter marked the inception of the Viking Age, as Lindisfarne became the stage for a clash between worlds. The monks, frozen in terror, witnessed the dragon-headed ships drawing near. Their eyes widened as if beholding mythical beasts, and in their sacred scripts, they etched tales of winged serpents and celestial demons. The sea itself seemed to seed with the fury of the Norse pantheon. But beyond the realms of imagination, harsh reality unfolded. The Vikings, driven by hunger for plunder, descended upon Lindisfarne with a brutality that echoed through time. They climbed the heights of the monastery, drew their swords and chased everyone around. Monks without a chance had to take refuge or surrender as sword blows squealed in the air. Monks, beaten and some to death, lay strewn upon the hallowed ground, their sanctum desecrated by marauders. The air was thick with the cries of the fallen, as Vikings, clad in the guise of monsters, stole silver, holy relics, and all that held value. The once tranquil island was forever changed. Lindisfarne, where history and myth converged, became the crucible of the Viking Age. The dragon-headed ships sailed away, leaving in their wake a narrative woven with both the harsh truths of invasion and the fantastical tapestry spun by the terrified monks who bore witness to an age of reckoning.